Here's how to get a professional vocal sound using stock plugins in 123 seconds. First, make sure you're using a good vocal recording. No amount of plugins will fix a bad performance. Then set a loudness meter as your first plugin and get your vocals to sit around negative 18 LUFS. This will mean you can copy exactly the settings I use and get a similar sounding result. Next, we'll add pitch correction. Choose the correct key and adjust the retime speed to taste. A lower retime will be more like T-Pain and a higher retime will be more natural. Next, put on an EQ. Use a low cut until it starts to affect the bottom end of the vocal and then dial it back. Then dip around 300 hertz to get rid of any excess muddiness. Most vocals could also use another dip around 800 hertz. Then take a shelf at the top end and boost around 8K. This will give the vocals some shine. Next, throw on a FET type compressor. Set the ratio to four to one. Set the attack to around 10 milliseconds. Set the release to around 50 milliseconds. Make sure auto gain is turned off and adjust the threshold till you're getting at least five decibels of gain reduction. Then duplicate that same compressor in all of its settings by holding down option, clicking and dragging. Then we'll adjust the threshold on the second compressor until we're getting about negative five decibels at least again. Next, add a stereo delay. Adjust the filters so the high and low frequencies don't interfere with the main voice. Then adjust the mix knobs to taste. Then we'll add reverb. Choose a preset based on the feeling of your song. Large reverbs are grandiose, where small reverbs are more intimate. Make sure the dry knob is at 100% and then adjust the wet knob to taste. And there you go, your vocals should be sounding much better. Here's a before and after. Before. Get what I always wanted. The door's been closed, but I'm keeping up. After. Get what I always wanted. The door's been closed. If you want even more sound options than the one I just showed you, I've created 10 free vocal chains that use these methods that you can drag and drop on your tracks to instantly get these results. Go download them using the link below. If you want to learn more about processing your vocals, watch this video up here where I go way more in depth into one of my favorite vocal chains.